I was at the Shangri-La Dialogue in yeah. Singapore that year that you gave the speech yeah. about the Asian way. Mm. Can you explain what that, what that means? Asia, Southeast Asia, we have experienced a lot of uh, foreign interference mm -hmm. in the past several hundred years, right? I always say, we never went to Europe, but the Europeans came to us. Mm -hmm. They basically colonized us. They interfered in our internal politics for hundreds of years. Mm -hmm. In India, in the Kingdom of Burma, in Indochina, Malaya, in China, China was invaded also in the last two, three, four hundred years, right? So we experienced that. We have this. And so, for instance, Southeast Asia, we were, we had wars in Southeast Asia. Fifty years ago, 60, I mean, you know, Indonesia was in armed conflict with Malaysia, with Singapore. But we solved it without foreign interference. We talked, we met. And that is the, the Asian way? I think so. Mm -hmm. In this current geopolitical climate yeah. where we see the US and China competing for influence all over the world, but, but also in Southeast Asia, how does Indonesia manage that situation of, as you say, being friends with, with everyone, in, in this case, the US and with China? Because we are very open. You know, we, 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 we come and say, look, we, we, we respect you. We are grateful to you for your past assistance and we welcome you. Please come into Indonesia, take part in our economic development. We invite the Americans continuously. We invite the Japanese, the Koreans. They are very strong here. They've uh, invested here. We are open to them. The Europeans we invite. The Chinese we invite. And you were recently in China. Yes, I was in China, I was in Japan, I was in Malaysia. You see, so uh, we are very open. Mm -hmm. And we tell them, please, you know, uh, by the fact that we are friends with you, does not mean that we cannot be friends with China, mm -hmm. with India, with Russia. Indonesia is in quite a unique position in that in that we are unique and I think uh, that's our strength mm -hmm. do you think there is potential for in Indonesia to play a role perhaps in diffusing some of that tension between the US and China or do you see that situation as already being quite manageable well if there are ways that we can be useful we, we want to be useful if there are ways that we can be useful we want to be useful but I think the fact that we we have to give the example and we have to give the, the initiative that we have to convince all sides that, uh, you know, um, the world is getting smaller and uh, prosperity of our people needs peace. There can be no prosperity without peace.